Hey everyone, I recently built a voltage controlled amplifier and an oscillator using Moritz Klein and Erica Synth's design. They sell kits, but I actually went ahead and built this from scratch instead. Uh, they have all the manuals and part lists available to download for free. Uh, I'll link that in the description. Uh, I ordered the parts off of DigiKey, and following along with the manual and diagrams, I got everything up and running. Uh, one note though, if you're going to order the parts um, and just do your own thing without the kit, Make your own part list, looking at the breadboard pictures in the manual. Uh, don't go off the full part list for the kit because there's a lot of extra things they throw in there that you won't end up needing. Um, there's some you know, safety things for plugging in a, a wall outlet and that sort of thing that you won't need because the uh, breadboards run off of 9 volt batteries. So uh, I ended up ordering way more than I needed for my breadboard design when I built the oscillator. and. Uh, just went off the breadboard part list when I made this VCA and I got exactly what I needed. Uh, anyway, here's a time lapse of the VCA building process. finished. My desk is a huge mess, but uh, the oscillator is going currently and it's not making noise, which is great. Before, it always made noise and as you pushed a key it would change the pitch, but the sound was constant. The VCA is like a volume knob that only turns on when you push the key. And now as I push the key, it makes sound, lets the sound through. doesn't otherwise. What's really cool is, is it's playing a sequence. Uh, you can turn this knob here and it will change the uh, amount that it lets through. So you can go from very short notes to longer notes as I turn the knob up. So super short, so I turn this, it gets longer. Short again. Nice long smooth note sound. Thanks for watching.